Ain't hey, no sunshine when she's gone, baby. Yeah. Is this your song or what? Hello my lovelies and welcome to another vlog. How lucky I am to be able to greet you guys from this spectacular place. I honestly, I'm out of words. I feel that like I'm so lucky that I have the opportunity to visit many incredible places. As you guys know, I've taken you to Ravello even before, but it's my first time that I'm staying at the Belmont Caruso Hotel. I think I briefly mentioned it in my last video, but I honestly, I'm so grateful to be here. I don't know if it's like this time like a special energy that i'm feeling here but i need to show it to you are you guys ready let me show it to you right now there's absolutely nobody at this infinity pool and the reason is that it was raining for a tiny hot minute but look at this space so it's an infinity pool with a view of mountains and the sea and it's so beautiful we had a little swim and when you get to that bit over there you actually can see all the little houses um like down there on the amalfi coast and i just think it's such an incredible incredible place now ravella is i think one of the most beautiful and completely like underrated places in italy and i'm gonna try to take you a little bit with us and explore a little bit more than previously that being said we are expecting to have not the best weather which doesn't really infuriate me because i do want to rest so like today is really sunny we even tanned a bit i don't know why i'm showing you like tan lines and we are going to have a beautiful day tomorrow my boyfriend would like to maybe do a little boat tour but there's one place that i really want to visit which is this kind of like infinity terrace i'm sure you've heard about it or you've seen it if you are interested in ravel if not this will be the video where you're going to find out all about it we're going there i'm super super happy because i've always wanted to see it and i i'm gonna try and force like kind of a right schedule by force i mean like i will force it upon my boyfriend that we have to go tomorrow to see the infinity terrace and we'll also do the boat ride probably if we do do end up doing one because the two days afterwards we're probably gonna just be chilling at a spa if the weather is bad but you never know you know look at that pigeon that was drinking water how beautiful also the nature is on another level you have this really long path that takes you from the pool to the hotel and then this view that i can never have enough of now I wanted to show you my outfit but i'm not sure you're gonna be able to see it so let's try to do my best are you ready to see this outfit i feel like you've seen it many times already because it's something that's been in my suitcase for a while now so we got chanel pants plate okay guys so can you see me i hope you can see me here we have i'm using this phone just so i can record myself because the camera is quite far we got the chanel pants these are the pants that i'm wearing non-stop i just love them and i don't want to have chanel pants and spend a lot of money on a pair of pants without actually wearing them over and over again chanel swim kind of same story you know what i mean look at this back beautiful it's a one piece it's a very flattering one piece i love it i'm wearing the row ginza shoes we'll link everything below and my favorite 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 off-white nina sunglasses we'll link them as well below if i can find them because you guys love them even more than i do if that's even possible so you like to shop them as well my Ole lingard elephant pendant and that is the outfit of the day i am gonna start tabbing into my latest things from netaporte from today because i just unpacked the box and filmed yes the video that you saw last this morning life is a winding road no telling where it goes driving through days and nights won't stop for traffic lights How was your day, baby? From one to ten. Ten. Ten? Also, mine was ten. 
it's so beautiful to be here and to enjoy the view, the sun. I even fell asleep for like 15 minutes today. This last swim, the water was cold. But the sun is now like, you know, the kind of like 6 p.m. sun. We're making plans for dinner, plans for tomorrow. Soaking up the remainder of the day. Guys, now is the moment. We got it all for ourselves. So we did like few pictures and even a little reel, which makes me obviously very happy because the content. I'm going to have a shower, to enjoy, to look at my new things and to have a little walk in Ravello city center, which by the way, baby, we've never been to. Even though since we've been together, this is the third time in Ravello. Guys, we're passing by, <laughs> back to the hotel. And these are the old, like old bookkeeping, right? Yeah. Banca di Maiori. <laughs> And then Albergo Caruso Belvedere, as you can see, it was like in 1925 they had guests. The money was still in lire. 5th of May, 1926. Wow. Even if the sky is falling down. Back in the room. I hope you guys can see me well. Um, it's getting a little bit dark. We are gonna go for a little walk. The sky is pink, baby. It's so beautiful. Right? For the first time ever, I'm wearing my new Loewe shirt, the silk white. I call the outfit of the night proper Shura Glam because it's very like classic and chic. French sleek hair. You'll see it. Hopefully, Filippo will film it in the city of Ravello in a second. So I'll show you, we're gonna have a little walk and then go for a romantic dinner. Okay guys, let me show you the outfit. I'm wearing the silk, um, white silk leather shirt from the last video. I love it so much. I think it's super chic. What do you think? Love it. Love it? My I also love the color. It's kind of a pyjama. Yeah, that's the kind of look tonight. Yeah. Also it's Sunday night, so you know, it's like casual. My elephant pendant necklace, we'll link it below. Gold mini Kelly. I put my serpentine watch. Same old jewelry as always. These are the row pants. I've had them since like half a year now. I wear them all the time. I love them very, very much. They could be ironed a little bit, but we didn't have time. And my Oasis sandal. I actually wanted to wear a pair of heels, but I think the roads we're gonna take now are mostly flat, but not really heel favorable, right? Yep. So I'm gonna go and check out the town of Ravello and we will take you with us. You guys wrote to me that you'd love to see what we eat for dinner. So tonight I'm gonna show you. We just received this mm, pizza bread. I wouldn't call it a focaccia, it's a pizza. Ah oh, no, it is a focaccia. Wow, it looks delicious. Grazie. And just Buona. wait for sì. the main course. I'm just having a little discussion that actually focaccia and pizza bread is actually the same because the composition is the same. But for me it's not because this is quite thin and focaccia I usually expect to be quite fluffy and more like a pan fry dish. You know what I mean? It's This is really, really great though. I am loving it. Our very light dinner consists of parmigiana. Parmigiana, because my boyfriend copied my choice. Yep. Una treccia. Baby, how was your light parmigiana? In my defense, the menu did say light parmigiana. Was it good? Not it that great, so huh? <laughs> and this dinner was perfect. We ate everything we ordered and it was just delicious. Good morning, guys. First, no, second whole day in Ravello. We're going for breakfast and I really wanted to show you how beautiful it is. So let's go. Here is my outfit of the day. Miu Miu top, Louis Vuitton silk pants. We are going to the restaurant. Here you can actually see it even better. That is the look of the day, no bag. We are only going for breakfast and coming back and then we're taking you guys somewhere. Can we discuss this breakfast view, guys? And my breakfast view, even better. <laughs> I got my soy latte, it looks delicious. I right. these cups, they are so, yes, beautiful, but not just beautiful, you know why they're so useful? Because they're never hot, the glass is never hot. Yep. We ordered Very some smart. porridge as well. Everything just looks like a dream. Honestly, like my hair, like my hair, I don't think it's looked worse in a long time, but that's okay because I'm on holidays, kind of. And I think they have incredible coffee. Incredible coffee. And one more thing I wanted to say 
is I told my followers maybe we're taking them somewhere this morning. We are. We are so. going to take them to the... Terrazza dell'Infinito. Brava. <laughs> Terrazza dell'Infinito. It sounds pretty amazing, no? Yeah. So beautiful. I love it here. It's incredible how like the sea sparkles differently at different times of the day. I mean, it's not that incredible because everybody knows it's because of where the sun is positioned. But it's just beautiful. The nature is beautiful. Love it. I mean, the start of the day is looking pretty, pretty nice. Right? Yep. Love this porridge. is so good, actually. I had it yesterday. Like okay, guys, so we just made it to Villa Cimbrone. It was a bit of stair climbing, right? And around 20 minute walk. And we're now here and gonna show you everything that we see as well. Oh, by the way, I changed my outfit because I haven't photographed this last night. So you can't really see it, but hopefully you will see it on my Instagram because I'm so inspired by this place that I just want to create content over and over again. I'm wearing the same thing that I wore last night except that I have a bikini underneath because I also have an extra outfit Where is the bikini from? Can I see it? It's Celine Let's see It's from... Yes, is it, it is. from last summer or this summer? I can't remember, I think it's from this summer um, And then we have of course... Uh, yeah The hat oh And God, then we have of course so our favorite beautiful. sunglasses And my Prada beach bag that I love so much Yep but really, This is so funny so Villa Cimbrone, it was a villa that was a residence of a British lord and it was very famous because the stunning view. You guys have to come to Ravello, you know, just even if you come to on the Amalfi coast, come here for a day and take a walk around because look at that. Wow. So what you see down there, look, I'm a pro like you, I'm doing like Tamara, you see there? <laughs> That part of the coast is Salerno. Salerno is the second biggest city in Campania after? Uh, Napoli. Well done. 10 in geography. So basically what you see there, as I said, is Salerno. And then if you go down, down to the coast, down, 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 you go at the end of Italy and there, there will be Sicily. And if you go up, sorry, I'm sure you're gonna be dizzy guys. If you go up, there will be Napoli and then there will be Rome. Rome and then there will be Florence and then there will be Milan. And then, uh, and then you go up to Paris and London and then to yep. Groenland, yeah. So we're walking to the most incredible terrace. What's the name? Terrazza dell'Infinito. What infinito means? What you and I are. <laughs> no! Okay. So we're gonna try to take some beautiful picture of Tom with some pretty outfit. Wow. Maybe I don't know if you realize, but I'm vlogging right okay guys three two one yeah and that's for you guys that's all for you it's another level of of course, there is a lot of tourists. We are almost at the end. Almost at the end. Here we go. Wow. Guys, this is so beautiful. I saw it on like so many different like channels, like travel kind of channels. But in real life, I think it's even more stunning than I could even imagine. It's so beautiful. Of these statues. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I'm sure that if you come early in the morning or if you're patient enough to wait, you will get the best picture here. But we have an outfit change to make because I want to do a picture here in another outfit as well. guys really strongly recommend you to come visit this as you can see i mean it is busy we try to kind of wait for our turn take a little peek for instagram but we got told off of course for because i changed actually this is so funny i never do this so i used to do this in like 2017 bring outfits shoot them early morning when there are no people you know like do my thing post multiple outfits because actually like it's kind of 
almost, I don't know how to say it, it makes sense, you know, like you take many pictures in one day and then you have content to post and then you don't have to actually shoot every day. Even if you do dress up every day, you still sometimes don't want to take pictures every day, you know? I used to do that, but never, like really don't do that anymore. Like I never bring outfits to change. And today I was like, I really want to shoot this one dress here, but it's impossible to walk in a taffeta dress with feathers by Valentino in high heels, even if they're Minamadi and they're comfy and they're with a thick heel. It was not possible to walk in them. So I was like, let me just bring an outfit, which I'm going to change into and shoot. And they were like, you cannot do that. Basically, they thought we were shooting like something commercial, like a commercial project, which obviously we were not. But I just couldn't walk in my high heels all the way here. So we were told off, but it's okay. And now we're gonna walk back to the hotel. We did nice content. We wanna go to the pool and chill and have iced lattes and so many cuddles. Maybe you. I have to work because it's Monday. Me also. I also have to work. I received already a, like a message this morning. Can we have a call today? And I just ignored it from my management team. No, no, no. Today, from today, is uh, we're back to work. Yeah. It sounds funny it's because we are in heaven, but we did triste. one hour work now, and now it's Monday. Pero Almost un... everybody are back at the office. Guarda, sono yes. un po' triste perché perché vacanze sono finite. Le. Vacanze sono finite. The I articles are, so much on the article. articles are not an opinion in Italian, you know? Also in English. Le vacanze. Le, va le vacanze sono finite. La vacanza è singular. finita. La vacanza è finita. Le vacanze sono, sono finite. finite. Sì. E sono triste? Io sono triste. Sì, io sono triste. Sì. Però io non è importante. No, sono triste. You can you don't have to say it, it's true. Uh, sometimes I have to give Italian lessons to my Italian boyfriend. <laughs> Say something in Italian now, properly. Um, Dove stiamo andando? La piscina. No, no, non, non vedo l'ora. Sì, però, if I ask you dove stiamo andando, you answer starting from the okay. question. Dove stiamo, stiamo andando? Stiamo andando a piscina. No, a piscina is uh, like... A... <laughs> to the pool. Yeah, stiamo uh, andando in piscina. In piscina. But that's if I'm going into the pool. No. Stiamo andando in piscina. It, it is, but well, I never had say. one lesson of Italian, and I mean, somehow I can get around with it. So I think that's pretty enough already. I think you. And doing, I understand everything. I think you're doing amazing. Oh my God! Can you, you guys see the little here? hearts? I'm the more romantic one. We both know it. This is really. My boyfriend wants to take more pictures of me because he's the best boyfriend of the century. But I'm really hot now. Oh, maybe this is, sorry. sorry, guys. It's me again. There is a little. Uh, Italian test here. Okay. Let's see. Qui nella primavera del 1938, la divina Greta Garbo sottraendosi al... Sottraendosi. Go. <laughs> sottraendosi Brava. al clamore di Hollywood. A eh, baby Hollywood W. <laughs> Not Hollywood, Hollywood. 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 <laughs> Okay. Hollywood in Italian. Hollywood, yeah. So Hollywood is like... No, in Italian it's Hollywood. Hollywood. Yeah. Hollywood. Conobbe con Leopold Stokowski ore di segreta felicità. Wow. You know, I have a goosebumps. You right? know what that means. Yes. But she came here for a secret happiness yep. with Leopold Stokowski. Which means uh, basically they were... I know. Oh, no, no. I know. A lot. <laughs> yes. Goodbye. Goodbye. Love this i'm a little bit obsessed with it these are the seven deadly sins i don't know if you can see because there are seven and it's superbia avarizza maybe invidia luxuria gola ira pigrizia it's pretty pretty i don't know like fascinating Guys, are you ready for a little bit of a beach day? I'm wearing literally like every single color on earth, but it's because I'm gonna take off. Obviously the bag is just because I love it and I wanna put stuff in it. I'm wearing my new Magda Butram pink swim, as you can see, with a pink leather shirt, like the white one that I wore today. My Coperni trapeze skirt. This is like the piece, the piece. And I got this because it's quite handy when it's too sunny and I, you know, <laughs> look at my phone. My Chanel sandals that I'm even too lazy to put 
put on because I'm gonna take them off in a second. So this is kind of the current situation. Many, many, many colors, especially for me. Also, you guys know which kind of fragrances I like. I even wrote a blog post about it, but at the duty free, I decided to get these two tiny versions of Jomo and Lime, Basil and Mandarin. We'll link them below in Fig and Lotus Flower. They're very light, very summery, perfect for the bag. And I like to layer these two, obviously not sponsored. Just Lime, Basil and Mandarin is like screams. I'm a cool girl and I think that Fig and Lotus kind of scream. I'm a sweet girl. So combined, it's like perfect. Really, really like them. That's what I'm wearing this holiday and it will remind me. I like to have like a different fragrance for different holiday because I know that it will then remind me of that holiday. I have to say also that the best purchase ever has been this bottle because it's just amazing, especially for traveling. I put my coffee in there and then I have it warm throughout the day. Love it, but I'm not going to bring it now to the pool because we have restaurants there. That's it now. Honestly, this bag I love so much, so, so much. Brada kills it for the beach bags. It's so good. On the way to the pool, this is the kind of site that you pass by. And I have to say that uh, this makes me feel like I'm in a movie, like a main character of a movie, especially with the music. <laughs> We're all main characters of our own movies, right? Anyway, now we're off to the sparkling garden. It's this way and it's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I think I showed it to you yesterday. It smells beautiful, as you can imagine, all of these plants. Love it. And then you come to this bit with all the grapes and the sound of the water around. Oh my God, I think we, there's my cat. Let's see. I think so, Fluffy. No, it's not my cat. I know my cat is not this. I have a new pet. This is it. We go to Milan. My cat doesn't have stripes like this one, but it's nevertheless cute. Ciao, gattino. Hey. And there's a black cat here. How beautiful. Sorry, I'm not even a cat person, but for some reason. Hey. Who are you calling? I mean, I love all the animals. I'm not like a specifically a cat person, but I love all the animals. So, hey, ciao piccolina, ciao piccolina. Are you like a five-star hotel cat? Do you want to be friends? Hmm? I'll switch off the camera now just because we're entering the pool area where there's many, many kind of half naked people and I don't want to intimidate them. I see the red. Uh... Yeah, it's filming. I don't know. Is there a red flashing? Yes. Okay, guys. Am I in focus, baby? Take this job very serious. Yes. <laughs> we made it to dinner. We saw the most beautiful sunset. I mean, the views over Ravello, I think, are in general really beautiful. What do you think? Yes. So you far, you cannot today, get any better. We saw so much beauty. I don't know what even to say. And we're about to order our dinner. Do you know what you want? I know, I know. What? Io prendo un spaghettone con pomodoro. Why are you laughing so much? Because you, I mean, you're never so excited like when you order pasta. Right? Yeah. What are you gonna have? I don't know. Let me think Let's about it. I wanted to show you what I'm wearing tonight without standing up, but it's inevitable. We're gonna have to do it. I'm wearing, actually, well, you might think it's a dress by Magda Gudrun, but it's two piece. Can they see it, baby? Yeah, they can. You just press the halfway button if I'm not in focus, yeah? You are in focus. So we have this body, which is basically one piece, and then a skirt that I'm wearing over it. Wait, because if she's not in focus, I'm dead. Huh? Uh, no, no, nothing, nothing. Nothing? No, you are in focus, yes, perfect. It's perfect? Yeah. Do you like my outfit? Love it. You know we love Magda. And I'm wearing these. Did you these. say that it's two pieces? Yes, two pieces. You see? Yeah. And the shoes? Today I'm very over, like overdressed, but you know. No, you're not overdressed. Elegant. I mean, you know. And we have this very special table where, um, you know, very romantic dinners take place. And it's very romantic, baby, because I'm with you. Oh, this is so sweet. You know who's more romantic between two of us? 100% you. Yes. But it's not that I'm not romantic. I'm just mm. older. Hmm? I'm well, just I don't think older. it's that. I think you just perceive like different things as romantic, not like the candles and the stars. More like acts of kindness. That's it. It's over. We have a guest. Hello? Hello, you? Excuse me. We have our bread selection, the classic Pagnotta Rustica, the homemade bread stick. 
I'm not gonna wait. Thank One you very second. much. Same. And the bread version of the famous baba. In this case, we do it with the parmesan cheese and lemon zest. Perfect. Wow. Are you excited, baby? Very. Looks delicious. And of course, we have a little pet, but I don't want to scare her because I would like. And you know, animals and light, it's not, yeah, advisable. Anyway. Guys, I just got back to the room. I don't know if you can see it. This got me so excited to have our initials on the pillows. I love it. Didn't even tell. But my boyfriend didn't even notice it because he went straight to the balcony. But how cute. This is obviously coming home with me. Guys, ain't you no know sunshine when she's gone, baby. Yeah. Is this your song or what? Um, I didn't hear a yes. Who is the singer? Huh? Who is the singer? Where, we got the best spot we, we, we with the most guys. incredible view. Look at this, guys. This is the aperitivo spot I was telling you about. It's so beautiful. Tonight for aperitivo, I have actually tried for the first time ever the Amalfi Gimlet. I think that's what it's called. It is the something that they have to try when Amalfi gin with lemon juice, and it's insane. My boyfriend is not uh, joining me because he doesn't drink, but this is so good, you guys. With this huge ice cube, I don't know how they make it, but love it. And we really have a beautiful spot. Also, my outfit is not so bad either. Do you want to show? in my outfit. Feather dress. Yep. I'll insert the picture. I'm enjoying myself a little bit too much. Tonight you will have to pack because we're leaving tomorrow so you're gonna have to pack. What about the shoes? My favorite salmon. What about the earrings? Cartier Clash. Do you like them? Love it. And the watch? We love it. That's it. My super diet continues. Summer. <laughs> <laughs> Summer body is here. Thank you so much. Margarita. Mm, baby is it Napolitan? It's a Napolitana. 100%. 100% Napolitana. It looks delicious. It's already like night and even I changed because we decided to have a low-key dinner here where it's like a pretty good time and um, a pizza so I changed to something more casual. Anyway, I'm wearing for the first time ever the Celine headband. You cannot see it now and I don't want to shout so hopefully you can hear me but anyway that's it. Good morning guys, it's our last morning in Ravello and we got a really nice surprise, it's a beautiful one. I say surprise because it was supposed to be raining a lot. I just put on my swimming suit as you can see for the first time, the Chanel one. Wait, let me try to show it to you so you can properly see all the detailing on the side. This is the one that I got in Capri. Remember when we were there for the Lucia Verma Gala, it seems like it was forever ago, even if it was not even that long ago. Now. Not the best light currently in the bathroom, but hopefully you can see me unpacking. My skin was so dry um, from all the sun and travel and flying and whatnot. And one thing that helped more than anything else, I mean, the truth is, okay, you guys let me know what you think, but I've been using a lot of like oils, like skin oils, especially like after sun, during the sun, like the ones with SPF, mainly using the oils, etc. the ones that were supposed to kind of like nourish the skin. And I think like that's what was drying it. Instead, what really moisturized it was this. It's the Sicily Black Rose Body Lotion. I really, really love this. I bought it at the airport and I remember it being good from before and it's really great. My beauty bags are almost packed. You guys often ask me how I travel and what I travel with. So let me show you. Okay, so here we have, this is my makeup bag. I always have this as my makeup bag. Just a classic Louis Vuitton one. Then we have a niece. This one I love so much. I mean, honestly, these two are my holy grails. Can you believe that when I got robbed, they also stole the beauty bags? Like that's kind of bizarre with my makeup and stuff. Ridiculous. But honestly, these are so amazing and I had to repurchase them because I really, really, really love them. And then I also have the niece in size down. How do I show you the sizing? Here we go. Look at this. So 
it's a smaller one and normally I don't really bring this one when I'm traveling every time but this time I just had a little bit more products because obviously it is um, summer holidays and you just need a little bit more stuff like hair stuff and things like that that I like every girl I guess needs and then my boyfriend has this one for his wash bag or beauty bag or I don't know however you want to say it but that's basically it we are packing now or like Philippe was already packed I still have to pack and then we are heading to the pool we're gonna be there till like 5 p.m pretty much I'm gonna be doing some work as well in the afternoon I have my laptop out here but coffee first a little bit of work then pool then a little bit more work and then we're heading back to Napoli so to get to Ravello you have to basically fly into Napoli or you can obviously also take a boat here but we flew to Napoli from Montenegro from Croatia actually from Dubrovnik to Napoli and then from Napoli we took a car which is like an hour airport and that's it so that's the plan tonight because our flight is quite late which is a little bit unfortunate considering that we're just gonna go home change our luggage and then we do have another two days of holidays a little bit more in northwest italy but i will take you on that in the next video i wanted this one to be especially for ravello my latte macchiato this is the best latte macchiato i had in a very long time porridge with water and berries because la squadra che vince a nostra cambia bravissima bravissima uh -huh. Every day pretty much I've had this porridge. It's so good. It's water porridge with berries. That's it. And what's then, the plan for the day? I already said it. We're going to school. Then maybe do a little bit of work. Then check out and back to Milano. Are you excited to go home? I'm ready. Okay. 